Hello, welcome to the Cozy Corner. It's your host, Cozy, and today I'm here to do the reading for the Leos. Um, Virgo just popped up in your reading, which I'm not gonna. Next door neighbor might be a Leo Virgo cusp. Hands are code, hands are code. <laughs> All right, I'm excited to do y'all reading. I was planning on doing them yesterday, but it's the 30th, so I'm managing to get all my readings done before December. I'm excited about it. My eye look like I'm tired. I jumped out of bed thinking I was going to be able to go and get my car oil change. And they took 20 minutes just to get three people information. I was like, I'm done. Bye. 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 So, anyways, I'm going to get it done tomorrow. I just got you that early. Okay. So, this is for your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. And this is for December 2019. This your month wrap up, man. This your last one of 2019. What y'all know? You will be getting mid months. Um, let's see. I will be making sure I get those out, um, like, or start recording them at least after the first week of December. So, I'll start recording those early, put those out. So, I'm going to upload all of these for over the next couple of days. It's Saturday. So, hopefully, they'll be done by Monday. And, yeah, that's what we're doing. I'm going to see how I can do it on my computer. If I can just transfer the videos on my computer. Do them that way. Or I'm going to have to just upload them from my phone. I don't know. We're going to see. But yeah. That's just an idea that I just had. Because. I would like to schedule them. But. Yeah. Got to charge up my laptop. So. Anyways. We go. Um, whoa. if you want a personal for me, the information is in the description below. Get them while they hot. I'm not doing Black Friday sale. I'm not doing Cyber Monday sales. Um, my prices are really cheap. <laughs> so I know everybody who else is popular and like have a lot of people, they might do sales, but don't look for a sale for me. Or just don't get one. <laughs> um, after the New Year's, uh, everything's going to change about my readings. I'm getting more ideas about how to set this up. So, for right now, I'm going to flow freely with it. But after December 31st, like December 31st, it's, it's done. Alright, Leo. You might have some conflict going on around you. Virgo popped up again. And the five of ones popped up. So, anyways. I'm going to shuffle one more time, and then we're going to get started. We're doing five cards because these readings have got really intense, so I don't even need multiple cards. So, yeah. Oh, first one out. Queen of Wands. What's she on? Let's put that right there. Oh, no. Oh, no. My ear is cold. Oh, six of swords, second one out. So, let's see. One sec. Okay. Obviously, spirit wanted me to have my hood off because this ain't, it was staying out the hardest time until I started this. So, um, now y'all get to see my big head. And my edge is not done. Um, somebody's being sneaky around you could be a fire sign sorry let me do that could be a fire sign arrow, Le arrow leo sagittarius you could be being sneaky around someone um let's see let me take that back Somebody's dishonoring somebody, or somebody confidence makes somebody feel dishonored. Like they don't have control, so they have to do stuff and put up a fight. Um, 
clarify the queen of swords i mean queen of wands whoa clarify the queen of wands here go another virgo card popping up in your spread It's your work ethic. It's your work ethic that they don't like. I'm reading this as something that like somebody wouldn't like, that somebody wants to like take away from or expose. I'm seeing the moon different now. Somebody's being very distracted by what's going on instead of what's really on the other side. I should have used that deck, but yeah, I got my new deck now. I'm seeing things differently and getting different downloads. But they're helping me discover that deck through this one. Um, funny how things intertwine. <laughs> um, it's your work ethic, though. They don't like that you're confident or so somebody's trying to dishonor that yeah they don't like the potential that you have and the potential that you see in yourself and it's always a fight with you four cups came back out um, it has something to do with this. I'm not going to say that it's clarified with this, but the moving on is something somebody's, um, feeling like they missed the opportunity to move on. Clarify six of swords. Clarify six of swords for Leo. So somebody's moving toward, like, yeah, somebody's moving towards something that's better for them and somebody's like, not happy. Because they, they got that offer before and they didn't take it. So now they're feeling some type of way. I feel like I'm dark. Hold on. My lighting sucks. Okay. I just want to try to see the cards and not for me to look like I need that to be in the light. <laughs> um. Could be a Taurus you're moving towards. I feel like this is gonna resonate with me. Okay, if you have Leo in your Mercury, you can watch this. If you're cross watching for Leo and you have Leo in your Mercury, this might be um, your energy. Something with dishonoring somebody. Five of Swords came right back out, so I'm going to take that one back. I just saw the Ten of Swords. Something's going to happen real quick where somebody's going to be betrayed. Okay, center of your reading. Let's see. Dude, I'm clarifying stuff. I ain't even got all five cards out. See, that's what I mean. This is intense right now. Seven of Cups fell out, but it fell face down, so... Ugh. Ugh. Uh, you know how um zombies look with the white eyes? Um, that's how people huh, find it again, Kayla. You got it. You can find it again. You got it. Y'all bear with me, Leos. Bear with me. This the deck I got. Bear with me. I just want y'all to see this because that's exactly what I saw. That's why I had to think about it. Come like no, that I should have used this deck, but I was scared to, so I'm gonna use it in um the mid months. Boom, and it's face up facing me how what I want y'all to see you see how he's zoned out over these options that's him on the other side 
So imagine this flip. This is what y'all see. Like, oh, bum bum bum, but it's really this. And they be wanting to talk so bad. <laughs> Woo! We getting to know each other. <laughs> Protective. So, it's like somebody zoned us. Just like, what is this? Why is this in the center of their reading? Why is this here? Why is the Seven of Cups here? Because one of those choices creates financial security and victory. Huh, hold up. Yep. But somebody still focus on which one is the star. Which one is the star? Like, they not even ending what they got going on to get to what, what is the star. Because the sun is a star. So. They still got other things going on, but still trying to find the star. That's not how it works. I'm going to show you how it's not going to work. I'm going to show you how that don't work, right? I'm going to show you. Just wait. <laughs> I be put, I be boosting myself up on stuff. People are like, that's why, that's why this and that. That's why this and that. But he coming. So I'm gonna show you how that don't work. <laughs> I cut everybody off. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Uh, you ain't moving how I wanna move. You ain't moving how I want, what I wanna manifest. Then, baby. So, um. All right. We gonna come back to that seven of cups. Every and every reading has been that we come back to something because it just be too intense. We gotta move on because that's a deep one. Um, fourth card out. Fourth card out. Okay. Fourth card out. Fourth card out. For the Leos. Whoa, strength card showed itself. Fourth card out for the Leos. Four wands. <laughs> oh my God! It's a decision you made after a heartbreak and what you wanted to manifest in. Like I was just fucking saying, you telling me, you telling me. I just talk. I just talk. It just comes out, and that's what you need to hear. Clarify the four wands for the Leos. Clarify the four. one of those options. Is your victory I'm telling you? Don't doubt me, bruh. Do not ever doubt the kid, bruh. Five, number five. What the fuck are you here? Hold up. We're gonna have to come back to you later, boy. I'm gonna put you in the deck. We're gonna come back to you and Seven of Cups. And a magician is Mercury energy, so yes, definitely if you have Leo in your Mercury. You might want to check your chop. Check your chop. Mm, man. <laughs> All right. No, I wasn't talking yet. I wasn't ready. Fifth card out for the Leos. Fifth card out for the Leos. King of Swords. Who is he? He coming in. Ugh. This is the person who's going to come in and try to start some BS. It could be a Libra. You walked away from them and you focused on your bag. God told you about this person, so you got your emotions together and had to cut this person off and go leap and do your Leo thing. 
they probably put you in a third party situation and make you feel like you it could be an Aquarius too made you feel like you weren't the star made you lack your confidence and you worked on that since then you made the decision to work on that and not feel so conflicted two 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 baby what the fuck two of wands two of swords two of pentacles in a row sometimes i go into this thing and it's really good you offer something to yourself that you kept holding back in the past probably you dealt with a cancer in the past um Mm -mm. No, in the past, this person always came straight forward to your face with some bullshit. Period. Because King of Swords is like that when he's in reverse. So this person probably was a toxic person. Let's see. It just made you feel like it wasn't going to grow. Um, you kind of questioned the structure of it. Could have been dealing with a cancer or they put you in a third party situation with a cancer but this person is coming around you know, intuitively got nudges about this yep that this person is coming boy I thought that was three pages in a minute okay you got two ten of cups ew do not do not do not take this person offer of love if they come back it's only for their own satisfaction You suffer while they run free. You suffer. You suffer while they run free. I gotta put this right. Hold up. Yeah. You suffer while they run free when you should have been doing this all along. And now you feel it. It's a burden. And so they're gonna try to trap you into it. This is like some long term ass shit they didn't bought out. They're gonna try. Oh, the King of Swords is just like that. They're gonna try to trap you in a situation where you can't even do this. You're gonna feel like it's a burden to leave and be independent and they might even feel sink they might make you feel like it's a situation with you two um like deep y'all might get married or anything like that but then that person acts like they're still single even though they married and have you in a stagnant situation where you think about how your money is going to come in. And then you have to start loving yourself again. And then every time you do that, this person is still there to block it. Oh, I'm done. They make you feel sorrow. They make you feel stagnant. They make you feel defensive. They make you feel stressed. They make you feel discontent. How many fucking emotions you want me to go through? I didn't mean to say fucking like that. I love y'all. I channeled off that one damn card with the whole damn deck. I'm just saying. Woo! Boy, did y'all see that? I ain't even. Nine of Pentacles. It's what I said. It's what I said. You carry burdens while I run free. Yeah, and you better be still carrying them burdens for me. You feel me? You see me? I'm running away while you do that. And you better still be doing it because I'm watching you even though I'm doing my own thing. You feel me? Hold up. Make my satisfaction good while I keep you trapped, stagnant. Look at this. And you still feel alone even though you with people. You still feel alone even though you with someone. You still feel alone. And they come in with some BS. Ooh, let's communicate. It's so passionate. I'll give you something tangible. I'll give you emotions. No, listen to your damn intuition. If you a cancer Leo cuss, you better listen to that damn intuition. You better tap that 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 damn in that. I don't even know what that. <laughs> better tap into that shit. <laughs> this psycho motherfucker coming. That's that seven of cups. Mmm. All right, let's shuffle and get into the seven of cups, bro. Ooh, I was trying to shuffle, and it just popped out. Seven of Cups, that confusion, bruh, and it's gonna have you having anxiety in the middle of okay, middle of your reading. That's what's coming out. That's horrible. Don't. 
somebody's trying to stop your change somebody's trying to stop your your good karma coming in Get a life. It's because they're discontent with something in their life. Oh, okay. Check that motherfucker. Don't just let somebody back in your life. You better peep the scene. You better peep that motherfucker scene. Peep the scene. Peep the dance. Look. Peep the scene, bruh. Don't go straight in it like this. You better peep that damn scene first. You better say, do I wanna? Do I wanna? Because this person trying to... Mm -mm. Alright. It's too many cards up there. Temperance in reverse, King of Cups in reverse, Hangman, Queen of Pentacles, yeah. Hangman was in reverse, yeah. Nah, this person trying to make you conflicted about who the fuck you are, bruh. And I started this off by saying somebody don't like your work ethic, bruh. Somebody don't like how you do. They don't like what you do, how you do it. They a hater and they trying to come and sabotage. It's always somebody trying to come and sabotage shit when the shit finna be wrapped up. Like, no, we're not starting my year off fucked up. I ain't finna be in no stuck in no last month situations. Make that decision when this confusion come around to surrender it. Now, I'm gonna break down the hangman and the judgment. Clarify the judgment. Clarify the judgment. Clarify the judgment. Clarify the judgment. You make a judgment call on this offer. You make a judgment call on what you actually think um, should be. Oh, God, look. Oh. Yep. Make a judgment call. Make a judgment call. I don't know. Um. <laughs> Um, this person is coming to you with some BS. It's only because of them. Oh, they're trying to involve you in another third place situation. Wrap that shit up. Sever that tie. Sever that thought of ever having anything with this person. Sever those emotions, them ten of cups. Sever all of that. That needs to end. And listen to your dang intuition. We all got intuition. You better listen. Whoa. And don't go because look what they telling me. If you go into this situation, all you gonna do is be the freaking wounded warrior. Like, do you wanna continue doing that? If it Ooh, he in reverse now. I don't like the one that wore in reverse. This is somebody who plays victim. They probably try to come to you with an apology and try to play victim. But you the actual wounded warrior. But you ain't got to say that you are. Don't even bring... Bro, just, just, just shut the fuck up. Just shut the up. Alright, because now I'm going to get nasty with you. Look, surrender. What you gotta surrender? Release. Surrender. Change perspectives on it. So, I thought they said plies. I don't know. What plies gotta do with anything? Somebody probably like plies or watch them on Instagram or something. I don't know. I don't care for plies, but, you know. Oh, I got drip for sale. <laughs> I like that song. Bruh, you gotta surrender to the completion. Surrender to the cycle completing. Surrender to that. That's what you gotta surrender to. Let's get y'all advice for the month. 
Let's get Charlie Vice for the month. Boy. Hangman right here. Boy, I just have to I just have to show y'all when it's whoa, the lovers. And this lover's been right here this whole time. Oh, why you want me to pick up this? What's this? Nine of Cups. Um be aware of that. Because really what's behind it is I gotta look into the symbols of that. That's why I gotta get I I gotta get used to it before I use it on YouTube. Like I probably get the book. I need to know. I need to know the full detail of this shit. I should have got the book. But I thought the deck was gonna be smaller, so I was like, let me get the deck. But anyways, All right. patience. Patience, your thing is coming. What you want? That changed the vibration. That was really loud to me. Um, throat chakra. Deception and envy. Material and spiritual prosperity. Sacrifice. Movements, choices, and decisions. Memory of love. Okay. Okay, hold on. I'm going to put that one back. I already told you. Heartbreak, home, power, truth. That's the judgment. Truth is going to rock this person's world. Because this person is just trying to trap you into something for their own judge, for their own good. They're not trying to actually be with you or help you. They're trying to benefit off of you. They're not. Why did I leave this card out? <laughs> That was the harmony card. I kept looking at it too. And I was like, what is a what what what? I'm trying to hear them. Work together, you guys. Work together. That's the only way only way. It's the only way. <laughs> All right. So basically what I'm seeing with all of these cards is first of all let's see. That's you. Hold up. That's you. So you need to be patient and you need to communicate about something. Could be dealing with a Virgo, like I already said. This person is going to actually trigger something in you. This is the person you want. But you got to be patient. Because it's going to come to you through communication. So it's not something you have to worry about. Um... Who? Cap 
Capricorn. Libra. Gemini. Somebody needs to be sacrificed. Let me say that. 12 is also Pisces. It's a Libra. Some of y'all dealing with a Libra and some of y'all dealing with a strong Aquarius because it's not a lot of Gemini here. That person got to get cut. Leo and an Aquarius? Leo and a Libra? However y'all do that, bruh. I mean, that's y'all life. <laughs> not laughing at y'all life. Y'all know I love y'all and I know that y'all strong enough to get through these situations anyways. That's the reason why you found me. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, these messages are real strong for December, so. It's your wrap-up. So, this person got to get wrapped up. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I love y'all, bro. I really, really do. I really, really do. I really, 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 really do. <laughs> Anyways. I will, I will see. I will love y'all later. <laughs> I will see y'all later. This reading was long, <laughs> buddy. And I'm still hot, buddy. So, we're gonna move on. Finna go do Virgos. Bye. Like, share, comment, subscribe.